everyone. It's Rochelle Ingraham of Your Sweet Connection, your ambassador of icing images. And today I'm going to show you how to apply the Love Print Flex Frost Edible Fabric Sheet from Icing Images over chocolate covered strawberries. Here I have my already melted Merkins chocolate candy melt. I have my paper potion by Icing Images. I have me a flat paintbrush, Wilton's brush, two toothpicks, my strawberries, and of course our Flex Frost edible fabric sheet. Before we get started, you wanna make sure that your strawberries are completely clean and dry. Cleaning them in apple cider vinegar, lukewarm water, will clean them off and make sure that you apply a paper towel and just dab around your strawberry to assure your strawberries are completely dry before dipping into your chocolate. Take our strawberry and your toothpicks, insert them at the top so that they are firmly in and ready for dipping. Take your melted chocolate and your strawberry and dip. You only need to coat your strawberry once. After you have dipped, scrape the bottom a little bit, apply it to your surface, press forward, and let it dry. So taking some scissors and your edible flex frost sheet, you want to cut out a nice size, nice square shape for your strawberry. Make sure you remove the plastic from the back of your fabric sheet. And you want the square to be just oversize enough to cover your strawberry. Taking your strawberry and your fabric sheet, you wanna make sure you size up your sheet to your strawberry because you may have to use a little bit more fabric to cover your strawberry. Some strawberries are bigger than others, so make sure you size up your fabric to your strawberry. Take you a pair of scissors that you use for only your edible arrangements and taking your Flex Frost fabric sheet. You want to cut two slits at the top. It's going to go right over your berry. And you can also size it up if you like to make sure that it's going to be a good position for your fabric to lay over. Don't worry about the cuts that you just made. They won't show after you apply the top piece over your fabric. So next you wanna take your paper portion and your image and apply a small amount to the back of your image or you can apply it also to your strawberry. You wanna make sure you don't spray too much so that you don't smear the image on your fabric sheet. So one spray or two and take your brush and apply it, just rubbing it in to the back of your sheet. And be careful that you're not smearing your image. And if you want to spray your strawberry, you can spray your strawberry, taking your brush and just lightly spread around the paper portion spray. Taking your image, focus on centering your image and you kindly just want to gently spread your fingers and then start gathering the fabric. It's very flexible and manageable to move around. So just start holding and applying to your strawberry and then you just wanna form your fabric to the shape of the berry so that it can lay evenly. Taking the top pieces that you cut, lay them down. Make sure no leaves get in there and just hold taking the top portion and just lay that over the pieces that were cut. Now anything extra, you want to make sure that it's smooth and anything extra, you can just cut it off. But you wanna form this all the way around your berry. If you have to stretch, you can do so. You don't have to go all the way around your berry. You can cut off the extra but you just want to straighten and smooth it out. So now that you have majority of the strawberry covered, 
you want to start focusing on closing in the top. And if you need to cut a little bit, you can go ahead and do so. But you definitely want to do it before you apply um, the solution. So just pulling it back, cutting some of this fabric off. And if your fabric tends to dry out, you want to take paper potion and your brush, and you don't want to directly spray it onto your fabric at this point, because then you're risk smearing your image. So just spray away onto your brush bristles, and then take it and just gently dab to the back of your fabric that's not holding, just gently applying to the back of the fabric and just firmly press onto your strawberry, making sure your leaves are out of the way and just hold. And if you have to cut this down, the top part down, you can do so, taking a little bit off the top. Wanna make sure that it's all smoothed out and then lay this over and holding it down so that it can firmly stick. And if you have any areas that is lifting up, you just wanna take your hand, your dry hands, and make sure that you hold down and that it stay applied to your strawberry. Then just taking your leaves and then spread them down. Make sure you remove your toothpicks. Set your leaves down over your image and then you're all set. And that is how you apply the Flex Frost Edible Fabric Sheet from Icing Images to Chocolate Covered Strawberries. For information on how to get this print and the Flex Frost Sheets, visit the website at icingimages.com.